Let's look at the four problems from last night. I will give you the answers. Okay, so check your answers, but you still got to work them out. So I can help you get started on one or two of them. So if you got it wrong, you can go back and fix it and turn it back in before tomorrow. Okay. If you have them all right, you'll be able to just turn them in today. And I'm going to have you all turn it in like you did the other day, whenever you just took pictures and uploaded it to Google Classroom and click turn in. Okay, so y'all need help on number three? All right. So you can do it um, several different ways, but I didn't pick this the 10 and the, well, yeah, I didn't pick the 10 and the five because one's positive, one's negative. I mean, one's negative. They're both negative. I can't talk. And then this one is a positive three and a negative six. So I picked to cancel out the Y's. So that means I need to multiply the three by two to get a positive six. So I can have the additive inverse. So then we have negative 20 X plus six Y equals two. And then we have the same second equation. Okay, so that should get you started. Add them together. Some people forget to add those, so be careful with that. Okay, so that's your hit on number three. So you can finish that. Okay, number four. My X's and my Y's are both opposite signs, so I could pick either one. Uh, the two and the three, their common multiple would be six. Five and 11 would be 55. So I would rather deal with smaller numbers. So I'm going to go with making the X be six. So I'm gonna multiply the top by three to get six and the bottom by two to get six which the top will actually be negative six. And that's what I want. I want additive inverses. So this would be negative six X minus 15 Y equals 27. And then the bottom would be six X plus 22 Y equals eight. Okay. So make sure your final answer is written as an ordered pair, and I'll show you that again so you see what the answers are. Okay, so make sure to get that done and turn in. You could probably get it done during class today and turn it in. Because today during class, y'all are just working on an assignment, and you're having a quiz tomorrow. So I will show you what the assignment is. It'll be on Google Classroom.